Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Sierra. I'm back. Oh, yeah. With a DIY video and Christmas. I love doing DIYs, especially during the holidays. So I did five different holiday DIY room decor or just decorations for the holidays that you guys can do that are actually cute. Like, they're not like lame. They're good, you guys. So make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel if you're new. So let's just get it. All right, guys, so the first DIY is this wood beaded ornament for your Christmas tree. And I've seen these wood beads like all over Pinterest. I don't know, it's a thing, they're trendy. So I'm just threading them through any kind of string that you guys have. And I'm using about eight or nine one inch size wood beads. You can get them from Michaels and just stringing them through. And then eventually you're gonna tie it in a double knot really, really tight. So it almost makes it look like a circle or at least like an oval. And then you're just going to cut your string and loop it around, tie in a knot, and there you have your Christmas ornament. This is probably the easiest DIY and I just love it so much because it's super minimal looking and I just love that so much. For the DIY felt garland, you're just going to need a bunch of different colored pieces of felt. And I got these from Michaels. They're super inexpensive. And you can use whatever color you guys want. I just went with a bunch of different colors, like very bright colors. That's the vibe I'm going for. Very anthropology-esque. I feel like all these DIYs are very anthropology. Basically, you're gonna fold the little piece in half, cut it in half, and then cut out little pieces, and basically just keep cutting, you guys. It takes very long. This is probably the most time-consuming DIY, just cutting out the little pieces of felt. But it looks super cute in the end, and especially if you guys went with a more Christmas-themed, or if you guys like the bright colors, it's really cute too. And you can totally use this, like, all year round. So, it's not just for Christmas, it lasts all year. It's a gift that keeps giving, you know. <laughs> Also, I use this to hang on my little mirror in my living room, but you guys can use it on a Christmas tree or around your bed. You can make it as long or as short as you want. And it's just kind of a universal thing. For the tattoo ornament DIY, these are so cute and all you're going to need are some temporary tattoos and these clear plastic ornaments. I got them from Michaels and these temporary tattoos were so perfect. I found them at Nordstrom. They're just super cute and Christmas themed so I went with a pine cone ornament and all you're going to do is literally what you would do on your skin if you were putting on the tattoos. Just put it on and wet it with a sponge and hold it there for a bit. And then to seal it, you're going to use some Mod Podge or any kind of sealant that you want. The one that I have is a matte finish, so I would recommend doing the classic one. I don't know why I have the matte one, but it still ended up cute. Then you're going to thread a piece of string through the little ornament to make it hang on the tree, tie it in a knot. And you don't even have to do Christmas themed tattoos. They're super cute if you use floral or probably like the flash tattoos would be so cute. This is probably my favorite DIY out of all of them and it is this minimal style wreath. All you're going to need is this embroidery ring. I got it at Michaels. And then you're going to get a bunch of fake or real, depending on if you want to go to the park and get some sticks. Um, I got some fake sticks from Michaels. All you're going to do is bunch them all together how you would want them to hang on the wreath. And all I'm doing is wrapping floral wire that you can also get at Michaels or craft store around the branches how I'd want them. And then I'm going to do the same thing onto the wreath, just wrapping them around. And then just using some hot glue, gluing on these little Christmas berries. And you can use whatever you want, Christmas berries, any kind of winter-esque looking flower thing that would look cute. For the last 
DIY. This is actually something you can legit buy from Anthropology. I'm sure it's hella expensive. So all you're gonna need is some felt pieces again in some cute winter colors. And then all I'm gonna do is draw a tree and cut it out, fold it in half, cut it out. So it makes a tree, you know, and do that a bunch of times. I'm telling you like a million times, you guys, you're gonna need a lot of trees. I was actually short. I could have done way more trees to make it look more full. But basically what you're gonna wanna do after you cut out all your trees is fold them in half and use a hot glue gun to glue down the back side of the tree and glue it on a stick. I found these sticks outside and they are perfect. Just cut them into the size that you want and just glue all the trees around the stick until it looks full. And then using these little tree trunk almost looking things, they're actually just pieces of wood that you can get from Michaels or from the park. Just gluing them with the hot glue again. And then finally just gluing the tree onto the pieces of wood so that they can stand up and be super cute wherever you want to put them. up if you did let me know down in the comments if you want more diys leave any other holiday video requests down below i love you guys so much and i'll see you next time Bye.